I have nine markers. How do you use markers to teach subtraction besides writing on them? Hi, I'm Jimmy, and we're here to discuss how to sub uh, teach subtraction for the very first time. If students are seeing subtraction for the very first time, the more interactive you can make things, the better. I have here nine markers, and it's a good start to teach subtraction because subtraction means taking away. So if you have nine markers and you tell your students take zero away, to sim simply ask them how many markers you have left. And then basically, you can take away as many different markers as you want and then ask them how many there are left. So for example, if I have nine markers and I decide to take away three, that's the same thing as subtracting three. To simply ask them how many markers are left and they'll tell you, hopefully, that it'll be six markers. Now, start back from scratch and take, let's just say, six markers away. Repeat, ask them how many markers are left, and they'll tell you that it's three. You can use markers, you can do blocks, you can do money, which is probably the most relatable example. So there's many different strategies, and it's completely up to you, but nothing wrong with starting with markers. So I'm Jimmy, and that's a few tips on how to teach subtraction.